Hello there, YouTubers, and this is Multiredify, bringing you part 13 of my Let's Play for Game Story Plus. I lost the number count there. Last time, we ended in this room with four hearts and a very scared Mamiga slash human who claims he was transformed into a Mamiga. Let's go this way. Alrighty, so now we are in the plantation. And the theme music is playing from the game, I just realized that. And what is this? What is this? That right there, what is that? Let's talk. The doctor from the surface is using the Mamigma of this island to grow red flowers for him. Similar kinds of events have occurred in the past, too. What do you have to say for yourself? Who are you? This gal fell down near the spring. She doesn't remember who she is. Probably scrap metal now. Just one thing. I've heard about some kind of special mushroom that supposedly helps recover one's memory feet. I wonder if that admit that'll maybe work on this poor girl too. Well, maybe one day we will find this mushroom, and perhaps she will be restored with her enemy. Memory. She'll be restored with her enemy. Alrighty. So this place could go by very slow and painfully, or I can make it go by very fast, considering I know what to do. I can't tell you. Look at this place. I have gone up and down this plantation several times, getting stuck multiple times. Luckily, I know what to do now. Let's just hope. Let's pray to dear God. Look at this guy that I don't die. Look at this guy. Oh. Hell. Oh, the Mimiga. Dots. Okay, maybe you want to talk. Dots. Okay, how about you? If you don't... Dots. Okay, they are all very dotty today. Oh, what? What? <laughs> okay. I can say it on his head. These things are so cute. I love them. Alrighty. Rest area. Look who it is! Look who it is! Yo! Haven't we met somewhere before? It must have been at the Mega Village. That witch misery brought me here. I really dislike farming. I'm gonna go clear my head with some fishing for a little bit. Do you like to fish? If there's another chance, maybe I'll bump into you again? And that was the guy we met in the reservoir where we found the silver lock and feeling in the game. What do you have to say? That's. That's. Dots and what is it? 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 Dots. Alrighty, they are a talkative group today. Oh, what's down here? Ooh, what kind of secrets are down here? Nothing. I was so pumped up and I was just so let down. There is this hole over here. I do not know how to get in that hole. I think that's just decoration. All right, let's continue. Oh wow. Wow, that scared me. Oh no! He he is he is pissed. He's like whoa! Whoa! That's the noise I imagine him making. When he was alive. Oh, oh no, there's another one. Alright. 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 Dang. Oh. He did not see that coming. He was just like, oh I see a pretty light coming out of my face. Oh shit, I'm dead. Alright, so let's go ahead and go this way. More enemies. Hey, die you. Sweet. Hey you. Die. Awesome. Fish. Holy crap. More of this. More of that. Oh, I forgot the fish shoot bubbles out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy crap, that was awesome. Oh, it's you. I caught something strange. You could take it if you want. It's inside the bucket. Let's look at the bucket. Peeked inside of the bucket. Inspecting carefully, you see an item of some kind. Shining within. Obtain the teleporter room key. Sweet, now we can go to the teleporter room. Which happens to be over here. Oh my god. Yes. Thank Christ, I don't want to have to jump over all that crap again. Alrighty, hey guy. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, you doing good yourself? Yeah. Yeah, he's a nice fellow. I like him. Teleport to Arthur's house? Why not? I found you, killer robot. Smash. I don't think he was a very nice guy. Hey! Hey, you! Are you dead or something? Jail number one. Oh. Oh. Oh, my little whimsical stars are hitting the bars. That's what's making that noise. Look who it is. It's the big guy. Num num gulp. Oh, you're awake. I thought you were already dead. Sue would smack you and you wouldn't move an inch. This place is a jail. Those who oppose the doctor are locked up here. 
to be used as test subjects for his ongoing experiments. Sue said so. You a friend of hers? You're a little bit too late. She was here as well. She worried about you so much. It was only a few minutes ago that she was carried off. Damn, a save. That sounds like something I need to save for. Now what do you say? And by the way, she snuck something in your pocket while she was taken away. Oh, did she now? What is this bitch doing? Digging around in my pockets. Sue's letter. Let's read it. Hey, it's me, Sue. I don't remember telling you anything about me. Oh, us. Anything about us. We came to the island as a research group. It was me, my mom, Kazuma, Professor Booster, and a few assistants. The doctor was with us, too. He was supposed to take care of our medical needs and did, I guess. But then... But that all changed when he found the demon crown. That crown used to belong to the master of this island. And it grants immense magical powers to the person who dons it. The doctor knew about it well before coming to the island. It's the reason he forced himself into our group. After he grabbed hold of the crown, that was pretty much it. We couldn't do anything about it. The only thing we could do was continue the research of the island under his command. He seeks to rule the surface using the island as a flying fortress. From what I can tell, he plans on attacking the surface with the enraged Momiga army. I was able to escape, however. The other researchers are probably... Of course, he's using the innocent Momiga to grow a large quantity of red flowers. And once he's ready to attack, he's going to send the Momiga into a state of insane rage by feeding them red flowers. With his powers from the crown, he'll control them and me, too. If you can get out of the jail, please look for a hidden safe house somewhere within the plantation. If my mom is still alive, then she'll be there working on a plan of her own to beat the doctor. Please, help her as much as you can. Before I forget, the password to get into the safe house is Roth's Evac. That's pretty much it. Okay. No. No. Okay. So, as you can clearly tell, maybe, the password was Cave Story. Backwards. I know. I know, it's a lot to take in. That's a clever password. Considering the fact this game is called Cave Story. <sighs> Mind blow. Alrighty. So now, oh! Hey, guy. Okay, bye. Wait, did he throw his arm? What the hell? Um. Go ahead and go this way first. Wait, wait. Ah, that's right. Something I wish to show. First off, that. That was beautiful. Alright, let's go up here. Right up here. All the way up here. Passage? Oh, you guys should fly up there in the original game. <laughs> the original, the 3DS version. Never mind. Statue chamber. Hmm. Halder. And Natupon. Miyakido. Dots. That's all right. Enough time wasting. Let's go. I just thought that was a neato room to show off. Never was able to figure out what to do with it. Actually, I just—I don't know. It struck me as like cool. I don't know. I feel like there's something important with that, but maybe we'll find out over the course of this let's play. Anywho, now we have a problem with Curly. She, as you can tell, cannot remember her memory. She can't remember her memory. So let's go ahead and try to fix that. So we need a certain type of mushroom. Well, maybe if we go back to Arthur's house, we'll find it. Just maybe, though. And here we are. And now I can finally heal up because I've been needing that for a very long while now. Now we'll go ahead and save. Now check this out. We're about to get two birds with one stone. If we can jump up here and then up here up here and then over here one last time one more last time and a third last time and we are here we are going to the cemetery I think I had some lag there now first off first things first let's destroy some of these mushrooms and the gravekeeper of course the gravekeeper always needs to die BAM and now before we do that if you look closely at the ground very closely um, right there this right next to my character right here. You see that little pixel moving on the screen? That is the husband. That was where he was at. Let's pick him up. My wife's been looking for me? That's probably because I haven't been home in a long time. Fine. I'll go home. Certainly you'll take me there, yes? 
Little man. He looks relaxed. And now we will finally see just what it is that's behind this door, since we can finally reach up here. It is a mushroom. Let's talk to him. Got some business for me? Yeah. Hmm, amnesia. Oh, that's terrible. Do you want the mushroom badge? Yeah. But you don't really need it then. No. Wait, you really do want it? Yeah. You really want it, no matter what? Yes. Then you don't need it. No. Well, then I'll give it to you. Now, the reason that was a funny little dialogue, you actually have to answer yes, no, yes, yes, no in that order. Basically say no when he asks about needing it, and yes when he asks about wanting it. Uh, otherwise, he'll just be like, oh, I see, or something like that, and then the dialogue will end, and you'll have to do it again. So now we have the mushroom badge. This is sure to cure amnesia. Let's check it out in our inventory. A mushroom badge obtained from my, from my pigeon? It serves no purpose. Well, shit. Do you think Do you think he does that? He, he goes around and just lies to people? Ugh! Found me out. That's just a normal badge. Say what? You say you're going to eat me? I'm a very, very valuable mushroom, and the only one in this cave, too. Snap! Don't think for one minute that I'll let you eat me without me putting up a fight. That's right, boss fight. It's on! He is actually kind of hard. Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, there he is! I didn't realize he was behind me. Alright! And so, oh, and now a bunch of little baby mob pigeons are gonna come out and only one's real, and it's the one that one doesn't die immediately. And then he comes at you sometimes, rocks fall out of the sky, and they do lots of damage. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do that. No more rocks. And eventually he goes up in the air like that, and a bunch of little ones come out. Um, and then you figure out which one's him, because that happens, and then dodge the rocks and let them kind of jump towards you. I think after three or four jumps he attacks you and then more rocks fall. And then, and then he does that. Ah, I couldn't dodge it that time. I can't figure out which one's him. Ah, I guess it's that one. Alright, yep, it's that one. It is most definitely that one. Alrighty. So far this is going kind of bad. Oh, he missed me that time. Alright, we're doing good. Oh crap, we're doing, we're doing mediocre. Mediocre at best. Oh well. Actually, not too bad. I died immediately the first time. I didn't think this was going to be a real boss fight, but oh god, that would have killed me. Yes! Yes! One go! I've lost. Obtain my pigman. Pigman. I think it's pigman. What a fun guy. Alright, now before we go and die, let's go back, let's go back and heal. Um, and save. Um, yeah. So that's how you get the mushroom that the Cthulhu guy was talking about. No, this isn't the save room, silly. Um, I think I might... Hey, no, no, let's go ahead and commentate on the way back. Because that's funner. Alrighty. Um. What? Alright, let's go return him. Alrighty, uh, go through here. Order plantation. It's not really too far of a trek, but whatever. Let's go ahead and get going. Alrighty. Okay. More fishies to avoid. And then there's this guy. And then we're gonna go through here with our infinite breath of bubble. Good times. Good times all around. Except, oh, I probably should boost through this. This is make a teeny weeny bit faster. It's the teeniest of weenies, though. Very teeny weeny. Okay. Oh, a sign! I love signs! What do you have to say? Careful with the spitting gunfish. No, they can be used as steps. Well, that was always very nice. Now, let us see just what happens when we restore him. Eat this! Do you want to use my pigman? Of course. Stuffed it into Curly's mouth. Quotes! Now I remember! Your name's Quotes! You and I are... Well, before a great number of us robots were sent to this island, we were sent by the countries of the surface. The purpose of the mission. It was the incredible slumbering power found on this floating island. And it was also about the demon crown. But you and I were different. We were sent on a mission to destroy that power. The island. It was a mess when we landed. 
ravaged by the robots. They murdered scores of poor little Mamiga. It was horrible. And finally, one man seized the demon crown. The robot's mission was complete and the island fell totally silent. But that was simply the beginning of the tragedy. The man who was able to capture the crown turned the Mamiga into beasts. And they began attacking the surface. I faced him and tried my best to defeat him. You were with me then. That's all I can remember. The crown bearer was surely injured by both our attacks that time. How about you? Can you recall something? Anything? Nothing at all. Our memory is back. Well, that's not very exciting. I'm fine now. Don't worry about me. Oh, here. Please keep this. Obtain the iron band. Iron bond. I don't think this does anything, but it probably does, and I don't know about it, because I'm uneducated. What do you have to say about that? I'm fine now, thanks for asking. Alright. So, that is what you need to do if you want to get the best ending along with achieving the booster 2.0. Now, before we continue through the plantation, let's go ahead and return Mr. Little Man, or whatever his name was. I think it was Little Man. Alright, woo! Over here, and we are just gonna free fall it. Bye bye, sperm kitty, I don't need you today. Another sperm kitty, don't need you either. Ouch! We'll go ahead and land so I can refuel my jetpack. We're almost back there, and go, go, go. Okay. Whew. Ooh, I almost fall. I almost fall there. Yes. Alrighty. Didn't fall a time. I'm home. Home sweet home. I brought him back to his wife. Home sweet home is the best. Wow, wow. That's a beautiful sword there. How about we trade it for my splendid gun? Why? Why not? Gave him the blade. Obtained the nemesis. Ooh, it's ducking awesome, apparently. What does this bad boy do? Holy crap! Wow. Uh, how far is the shoot? No! 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 Ah! Oh. Damn it! Have the spur. You can just put use this like put on the spur. And, you know, equipped it to you, and then the star show. Mm-hmm. Oh. oh. And we're back. Sorry about that. I actually died twice more trying to get there. But here's how far the nemesis can shoot. That is very, very good. Let's go ahead and see how much damage it does, because if it does a sizable amount of damage, I might start using this as my main. This might be better than the spur, but probably not, considering I always hear everything about the spur. Um, just probably because of the simple fact the spur doesn't require leveling up, I might be using that more. But we will find out, won't we? Wow. Wow. That did a lot of damage. Okay, well, trick question. Can this level up? Is there some reason why it won't level up. Come back here. Come back here. Wow, what the heck? I picked up one gem and I leveled up. What is this gun? Okay. Okay. I actually really like that, to be completely honest, that it levels up off just one gem. And then it just levels back down. But one shot does 12 damage. That's crazy. Leveled up. And leveled up again. What? Oh, what? Holy crap, that is interesting. So, this gun, if it levels up, it actually gets worse. That is really interesting. That explains why it levels up so easily. Well. Well, now I've seen everything, haven't I? And I cannot make this ledge. No, no, no! Okay. I cannot afford to hit an alligator. Alrighty. Okay, so this gun... This gun... I'm going back to the spur just because... If that's as powerful as it gets, that's really good. But you know what? That's probably only going to be worthwhile during boss fights. Um, let's see. Kitty, 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 kitty! Sperm, 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 kitty, kitty, sperm, sperm. Alright, come on. We're almost there. We are almost there! We are arrived! One health. What you know about that, bro? Alrighty. 
Let's go ahead and continue this madness of the game. So now we know that our main character's name is Quotes. That is a very excellent name if I do say so myself. So let's go ahead and go over here. Go here, here, down here, and bam. What's the password? Cave store backwards. And now, here we meet. So you're the hero Sue's been talking about. I'm glad. I'm Mamorin Sakamoto, Sue's mother. I took my chance working at the doctor's side. But after the flower seeds were located, I was of no use to the doctor. I was thrown off of the island unceremoniously. Not very nice. Men who treat women without respect are barbarians. Anyway, that aside, I'm, pleasant I'm presently building a rocket for you. It will take you all the way up to the doctor's throne. But ev evidently, I don't have enough of the parts. Oh, I'm going to borrow that. Mormon takes the booster 2.0. Great! There's still not enough of the necessary parts to complete the rocket. Are you busy now? Nope. That's a good answer. To be expected from a hero. For the now, wear this. I have the Mamiga Mask. Awesome. It suits you, even if it's a tad too large. The Mamigma working in the plantation are forbidden from speaking with any humans. With that outfit on, you should be all set to chat with them. Got it? There's a minimum amount of electricity needed in order for me to finish this rocket. If I can get one of those sprinklers in the plantation, that might be just enough. Please do whatever it takes to get a sprinkler. Will do, and I there's an achievement for completing the game dressed as I'm Amiga like I am now. Let's go ahead and sleep so we can get all of my health back instead of just the one bit that I have. Much, much better. Game saved. Back to the door. And let's go find us a sprinkler without our booster. We are going to be playing hell trying to get that sprinkler. Well, maybe not. The sprinkler is not too hard to get. So now with this Mamiga mask, I think these guys won't hurt you unless you touch them. Something like that. But now the Mamiga will talk to you. Red flowers are being grown in preparation for an attack against the surface. If what the doctor says is true, well, we'll need to make these red flowers bloom at once. Die! Die! Alright. No, speak! Speak! Speak your mind, lad! Defeating the mean killer robots will be so simple with the red flowers in our possession. Bloom quickly, little red flower. Well, that is a one crazed ass meal. Ouch. What do you have to say? Long live the great doctor. Oh my god, these guys are brainwashed. Up and over. Up and over. Wait. Wait. No, we need to be down here. Rest area. No, wait. No, not here yet. I lied. Not yet. Ha. He missed. Can we make this jump? Can we make this jump? Oh my god, life hacks. I made that jump. What do you say? Not you. 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 Why aren't you working? Because I am a dodo. Okay. What do you say? You. You're a new face around here. You must be puzzled having been brought here so suddenly. Whatever. But don't even think about doing anything rash. If you run away and are caught, they're gonna toss you in jail. I'm safe and get to eat my meals, but that's only as long as I take care of these, their silly flowers. What's this? It has stopped. Awesome. What do you have to say? It broke again! Hey, you, new guy, go exchange the sprinkler with a new one that hopefully works. Okay. Hey, come here, sprinkler. I got the broken sprinkler. Now, I don't think this is going to suit anything. But actually, wait a minute. I want to see something. Um. Um. Let's see. We're going to go over here. Over here. And up here. And then here. Here. And then up and over. And then over here. Yes. Deal number two. There are a bunch of Amiga in there, and then a bunch of Amiga in there, and then there is a teleporter. Where does this lead? The destination is unknown. You still must teleport? Of course. Why would I not? And we are in the shelter! Back where Kazuma was originally held captive. Very, very interesting. So that's there. In case you need a quick save point or a quick refill of health. All that jazz. Now, since this sprinkler is broken, like I said, it's not going to do us any good. So we're going to have to go find a new sprinkler, or repair the sprinkler, or whatever comes first. So let's go ahead and get right down to that. And by doing that, we have to go and get down here. Damn you! Enter in the rest area, where these Mamigas are endlessly resting, and talk to this shady fellow. It broke again. Gave him the broken sprinkler. 
Use this one more carefully. Obtain the sprinkler. Ooh. Oh, now we can do stuff. This one's not so broken, so this one will work better. Hey! Not my face broke. Alrighty, we're gonna over, over, and over, and then this guy is gonna be loud. I don't know why, but I love his stance. And so we're gonna bring... What's the password? Negative cave story, I don't know. Here's the sprinkler. Let's have a look. More than enough battery power on this one. I think this might work. Next, can you look for a man by the name of Aito? He conceitedly calls himself a famous technician, but he's a big fat coward. Aito was the first to run from the doctor, but I don't think he got very far from here. And we already met Aito! Remember the scared Mamiga that we met hiding at the beginning of the plantation? That was Aito! It took me forever to find him when I played through this game the first time. I was like, where is this man? There are Mamigas all over the place. And then I was gonna backtrack and I found him here and I was like, oh, Aito, that's me. What? Sakamoto is making a rocket? I had no idea she was still alive and well. She's really strong. Compared to her, I am. Alright, take this. Obtain the controller! Awesome. I think perhaps that this is what Sakamoto needs. Say hello to him for me. Will do, you big coward. And so now we're gonna go ahead and return to Miss Sakamoto. With this new fancy schmancy controller that we have here. And she is going to love it. Alrighty. Here you are. Welcome back. Did you find Aito? Gave her the controller? There's no doubt about it. Aito made this controller. Hmm. Without him in there helping me, it'll be difficult to perform the analysis. Well, I'll do what I can. You've done well. This process will take some time before it's finished. Take a rest down below. There's a bed for you. Alrighty. Before I do that, I want to go ahead and take this mask off, because I think you have to unequip it. Wait, wait. To keep it. I may be mistaken. I may not be. No. No. Well, oh, crap. There's a way to end this game with the mask. I don't know how to. Oh well, we're saving. Maybe one day. I'll find out how to do it. Okay, so I went ahead and looked up how to do it, and it means I can't get my booster back, which means I can't get the best ending, so I am not gonna show that off. Uh, wait, I didn't sleep. Why did I not sleep? Let's go sleepy. Sleepy poopy. Sleepy poopy. Alright. You're well rested. Let's save again. Enter through these doors. Back up here. And now, they are outside. Aito and Sakamoto. Miss Sakamoto, to be sure. Did you sleep well? The rocket is finished. Surely you can beat the doctor, yes? I believe you can. Please take this. Got the booster 2.0 return to me. You won't need the mask any longer. And she takes my mask. Directly above us is a way to lead to the throne. You should be able to make it there using this rocket. The Amiga and the plantation are all gone now. That means the red flower might have already been put to use. Well then, please get on the rocket and hurry to the doctor's throne. Not yet! Not yet. First off, let's equip this. Yes, 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 I know how this works. And it's equipped. Alright. Now, I actually, I almost forgot of a health up. And we don't want to forget any health ups. We really don't want to forget any. Now, I'm only assuming there's a health up here, because I can't imagine they took out this spot in the uh, original version. They're like, yeah, they didn't exactly take out the spot, but you know what I mean. Come on, oh my god, these things are killing me! Alright. But yeah, I know there's a health capsule spot up here in the 3DS version of the game, but I'm not so sure about the original. Let's check it out. If everything will die. As you can see on the map, there's a small little area up there. Yes, here it is. The health capsule. Alrighty, increased by four, which means we have five health left. Where is the final health capsule? I know where it is, which means we're going to be able to get all the health in this game. Well, there you go. This is a semi-100% run. Well, actually, maybe my count is one. I'm doing just about everything, except beating the game with the mask. Except showing off the machine gun upgrade and stuff. Yada, 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 why am I going down here? Let's go ahead and continue this Let's Play and get rolling. Do you want to launch rocket? Hell yes! Watch me go! Watch me go! Watch me live and holy shit! Alrighty, here we are. And that thing goes back down. I don't know if it'll kill you or not if you do. We're gonna save, and we're gonna go ahead and end it here. 
this has been part 13 of Let's Play Cave Story Plus. This is Multi-Redify. Thank you for watching.